I've got two large chicken breasts. Um, cut them up into pieces, small pieces like this. I cut them up into pieces. And I put them into a bowl. All of them. Get in there. Pour in, mate. Very nice. And then. Then what we do is we put this bowl away. We got some dark soy sauce. Very, very lovely soy sauce right here. What you want to do is pour it in all around. Very nice. And then. Very nice. You didn't measure your sesame oil. Sesame oil. Then you got the honey. <laughs> oh, I forgot to mention that's four tablespoons of um, soy sauce, dark soy sauce, and then there's three tablespoons of honey right here. So you just drop that in. Make sure you get it everywhere, all around. There you go. Don't want to waste any. Just all right, then. get it all in. <laughs> there we go. And then then so now you got the asda sesame oil right? <laughs> you can get anyone you want but asda's oh good i can't really open it again. hold up asda sponsor us uh, pause it i can't open it oh. <laughs> so what you want to do is you want to get two teaspoons two one gorgeous there we are. <laughs> so yes, now we've got some Asda again, some ginger ground powder. You want to add two tablespoons, I mean... Teaspoons. Tea That's the one, thank you. Two teaspoons of that. Oh look, I see your hairy hands. Is it going to come up? Huh? Oops. I don't think you put Open it on. the other side. What? There's another side. What's that going to do? Do you want to explain? So the other one got stuck, so we're just using... East End. Exactly. Asian classic. I don't know how much look. So you get um, two teaspoons of this. And another. Finally, it's got in there. So now we're gonna pour um, two teaspoons of garlic powder in. Oh, two. no, I just had one. Huh? One is fine. No, we need two. Half. Alright. Lastly, to the mixture, I will be adding some <laughs> fresh Asda orange juice. <laughs> About half a glass, yeah. one cup, maybe two. That's one, one, one and a half cup orange juice. There we are. And then? Now, what we're going to do is put your hand in and do this motion right here. Mix it all together. Make sure your hands are washed. Oh, wash your hands obviously. Um... So I'm just gonna add a bit more soy sauce because the mixture's come out a bit light. Just a bit more. Optional depends how strong you want it to be.
do you reckon? Yeah, I think that's enough. You leave that's it to marinate for half an hour. You just leave it to marinate for half an hour. <laughs> no, like. There she got put in some. Oh, oh oil. I will say about three tablespoons then. Put about three tablespoons of oil into the pan. What's that? That's one tablespoon. That? <laughs> yeah. That is one tablespoon. Yeah, that's about two. That's enough. Yeah, that's about three tablespoons. And then. One back to yeah. You commentate while I do it. I'll do it. Oh. Oh, no, don't do it. Oh my god. Right. Now you're gonna get the chicken and put it. With the spoon. <laughs> yeah, with the spoon and then you're just gonna fry it. Take the juices out. Well, you don't really need to do that. Dalia is the juicer. No, we're gonna use the juices for later. Yep. Okay, that's what you think. No, you mix it a bit. I just, um, it would have been better if you had a wooden spoon. Move it around the bit. Slippy. What was that, Michelle? Slippy. Little bit. Little bit. Just a little bit. Sure that was what I was doing. It's cooked. It can move a bit. Was it cooked? No. It's gone a bit watery. Isn't it? It's done, right? We're done. It's still, it's still, well, it's still, it's dissolving inside the chicken. Now turn it off. Take then in another pan, you put in your butter, mix it around a bit. About four tablespoons. About four tablespoons of butter. Do you need the spoon on you? <laughs> yeah. Now we're gonna put in the leftover sauce from before. Oh, that's so nice. Stir it around. Okay. And then what? Now we're gonna add one tablespoon mm -hmm. of pack. from the holes. No, it's not, it's open. Let me see. There's done, it's done. Got enough. Huh? And then... That's fine. Uh, one, one tablespoon of mixed herbs. One tablespoon of mixed herbs. <laughs> Mix that together. Just <laughs> with one spoon. Hmm? <laughs> Mix it with that. Who's that? <laughs> Ooh, you see that sauce there? And then? This is gonna add a bit more. Uh, That's good. Then I add one tablespoon of lemon juice. Then we're adding a bit more soy sauce. It's like one tablespoon. Mm. Half 
half te add half a tablespoon of uh, black pepper. Then add one tablespoon of salt. One tablespoon is gonna be too much of a half tablespoon. That's too <laughs> like half a tablespoon of salt. And then you're gonna mix it well. Now, after mixing it, we're going to add in the chicken that we've already fried into the gravy. And just mix that all together. Now we're going to add like a handful of spring onions into it and give it a good stir. Yo, look at that colour. Oh my gosh. Wait. Let me look at that colour. Why are you making more sweet? You look beautiful. Wow, you make it sweeter. Tell you the chicken meant to be sweet. It looks delicious. I don't know if it's a good one. Another handful. Another handful, and then give it another stir. Is that enough to get in? Cooking on medium high flame. And um, it's looking done. So these are all the ingredients that I'm using to make the masala chips. Um, these are like okay. when I cook, I'll um, tell you what measurements to use for each ingredient. First, we're gonna pour some oil into the pan Crikey, a little bit and then okay. I'm going to put in about two tablespoons then we're going to add about four tablespoons of butter and let that heat up a bit Alright, then I'm going to add two, two red onions into the pan. Large onions. Two large red onions. And then give that a stir. And then we're going to add in the pepper. So I'm going to add half a green pepper Very nice. and half a red pepper. This one looks very nice. <laughs> Shall this one look nice? <laughs> look your way. Yeah. This one already occurs. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Cook for about two, three minutes. I'm gonna add the whole thing. Now I'm gonna add one uh, chopped tomatoes. He's got. A bit of garlic in it as well. So. One tin. One tin, yeah. Put that all in. Give it a stir. Oh, it looks very good. Cool. Mm -hmm. 
now I'm gonna add two tablespoons of chili sauce. Any kind of chili sauce would do. Crikey. Mix it a bit. And I'm gonna add about uh, half a uh, tablespoon of ginger powder <laughs> and about half a tablespoon of garlic powder as well. I'm gonna put two of those in. Mix it a bit and then. Then I'm gonna add some oh, really? dark chili so uh, soy sauce. I can't remember, man. I need so long. And add about three tablespoons of that. Then I'm gonna add, gonna add some gonna add some lemon juice. That's two tablespoons. Um, paprika about half half tablespoon of that that's going to be half tablespoon of that half it by your half tablespoon so then I'm going to add half tablespoon of black pepper I'm adding half a tablespoon of salt. It's professional, isn't it? Thanks. So I'm cooking this on high flame. about another one teaspoon of salt in. Let's stir. And I'm gonna add some extra soy sauce to just like just a bit more maybe dash. Stir it. Then add about one cup of spring onions into it. So. Put it in with your hand. Put it in the chips. <laughs> Mix it all in. Get the chips. 